one of the newest comedy animated series that found its way onto the Netflix streaming platform is Inside Job, which will make you question yourself whether the deep state exists after all these years. And with the first season under its belt, we're ready for the second one and we're here to tell you everything we know about the second season of Inside Job and take a first look into where things are standing right now. Jesus, can we turn on the lights for once? Ah. Some of us have hangovers, all right? <sighs> recap. Before we move on forward with what is coming up, why don't we take a short recap of the series, a reminder of sorts for all of you who have watched it, and maybe a detail or two for those who still haven't made their decision to binge it. There will be spoilers up ahead, you've been warned. And with that out of the way, let's dive right in. To say the least, the series will remind you of American Dad, but in a much more paranoid tone, or even Futurama. But a little bit more down to earth and the present day we're living in, Shion Takuchi is the executive producer of the series who managed to take an askew view of the world, which means that a cartoon about a shadow government that runs the deep state seemed like a perfect thing for him. The unique thing about her and the other writers of the series is that they managed to base the show on character-driven humor, however, with enough gags to make sharp-eyed viewers burst into laughter. The main characters are established right off the bat, Reagan has a personality problem as we see when she uses an attack robot to get her team to file their timesheets. Brett is so blank-faced that even the way he's animated is featureless, and when the two are combined, their true characters come to life, progressing ever so slightly with every next episode. The cast, chock full of big names, is also a detail that helps the series, as we're especially tickled at hearing Slater as the paranoid and off-kilter Rand, the constant supporter of his daughter, while also being the biggest thorn in her side. On the other hand, Kaplan, Duke, Campbell, Gelman, Daly, DiMaggio, and Lee all are doing a fine job to embody their characters well and not just be celebrity voices from the background. We mentioned Futurama, and it seems like it's the direction of the show tends to go in the future where it becomes a workplace comedy that happens to take place in a very unusual workplace. And if that's the case, then this is bound to be a satisfying show with characters who grow, change, and in some cases, stubbornly stay the same as always. The series is quick on its feet to establish its characters, its brand of humor that goes beyond just seeing lizard people struggle with the Keurig machine in the break room. And this is exactly the reason why the series will last for a few seasons moving forward. Season 2 Renewal and Release Date Even though the show was released just a few weeks ago, it was received with widely positive reviews, mostly being praised for its absurd premise, subject and creative execution of all the real-world issues we're facing today. The series was also commended for offering a refreshing take on real-life conspiracy theories that have been around us for decades now. Allow the new generation of viewers to be aware of their absurdity in a digital age while simultaneously navigating the complexities of emotions anyone can relate to. Netflix has ordered 20 episodes of Inside Job as part of Takuchi's multi-year deal with the streaming platform. Season 1 began streaming on October 22, 2021, delivering the first set of 10 episodes to the small screens, with another 10 guaranteed as of now. And because of the positive reviews the series received, we wouldn't be surprised for more seasons after the second one to be announced sometime in the future. However, at this time, there's still no concrete information about the second season of the series, but we'll get that soon enough. We're more than certain about it, Netflix may follow a similar release date schedule as season 1, with the first season being announced in June 2021, a release date provided in August 2021, and an official trailer for the season dropping in September 2021. Thus, the second season should be expected to release around the same time in 2022, sometime in October. Season 1 Finale Setup the season 1 finale of Inside Job reveals that Rand Ridley, Reagan's father, has tampered with her mind because he wants her to continue his legacy incognito incorporated. Reagan confronts her father and the ensuing commotion leads to her being removed from the company. In the end, Rand steps up as CEO as the majority shareholder. The cliffhanger of season 1 offers branches of possibilities for the second season, being the ambitious genius Reagan is, she'll surely find ways to topple her father's rule, liberating herself from the pressures of corporate succession, an action that would eventually let her make a difference in the world. She might also learn how to navigate relationships, especially if there are new characters to be introduced in the second season of the show. Season 2 Cast 
No details regarding the cast have been released yet, and since we've speculated that the series will come almost a full year after the recent first season of the show, it's understandable why that is. Seeing how things are right now, we wouldn't be surprised to see new characters joining the series, however, we still don't know who they might be. Considering the collection of talent the first season of the show managed to gather, including the likes of Bobby Lee's unhinged Dr. Andre Lee, John DiMaggio's gruff half-dolphin, half-man military vet Glenn Dolphman, Clark Duke's petty boy, Brady Hand, Tisha Campbell's quick-witted manager of communications, Gigi, Ron Finch's humorous take on Mothman, Cognito Incorporated's heads of human resources, Brett Gelman's uber horny magic mic, the giant ultra profane talking magic mushroom and John Daly's JR Shimpo, the two faced CEO that runs the company. We're more than sure that there will be more in store for us in the upcoming season of the series in the casting department, as we're expecting even more great performances once the new episodes drop when the time comes. Season 2 Plot There's no denying that the Inside Job series is all about the characters that quash potentially cataclysmic events from destroying the world at its core it's a story about two dysfunctional families the one at work and the one at home you're born with the socially awkward tech genius reagan ridley is the one who leads the cognito incorporated crew the one who also struggles to find success and relevancy at work while butting heads with her father and former company leader ran ridley their relationship and their deep-seated trauma is the thing that forges their bond, building the framework for the entire series throughout the first season of the show. After Reagan learns the manipulation her father kept as a secret from her, him removing a childhood memory from her brain to keep her in line, the first season ends with a cliffhanger that flips the power dynamic between her, whose promotion to company CEO has just been taken away, and her dad stepping back into that position of power. So where will things go from here? Well, to say the least, the series will continue its focus on the Shadow World and all the different players in it and all the new characters that are about to join in the future. We will also see more conspiracies explored and just what kind of twists we put on them. Takuchi also added that the fun thing about writing such an absurd show is that if you need to adjust something in the canon, there will always be a weird funny way to accomplish just that. On a related note, tell us down in the comments below what are your thoughts on the series if you've watched it, and which element of it has been your favorite. And also don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon if you'd like to see more videos like this in the future. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you next time.